all right guys splits here and we've got big news playstation has officially announced that we will be getting a system software update 4.50 there's a lot of good updates they did on this also i'm gonna share what they what they're actually gonna put so keep in mind it's not fully live yet it will be um soon they said but we're gonna see what they're gonna add in this new update so finally guys they have finally announced external HDD supports. I've always wanted the PS4 to do this. Basically what this is now is that if you have a hard drive and it's a USB, it's like a it's like you can now save storage onto that instead of going to the PS4 internal hard drive. So you can now use an external um, hard drive now, so that's really good. And you can and the hard drive can go up to eight terabytes inside that's huge guys that's you can that's a lot of games actually so just plug in a usb 3.0 hard drive into your ps4 and you'll have more space on the console so thank you playstation i will do a video on this uh i will do a video on on all of them what they added once it's fully out so yeah external hard drive support big update all right guys so next update we got our custom wallpapers yes guys so now that you have a screenshot you can now set it to the ps4 home menu which they finally did so if your picture or screenshot is too bright you can actually dim it so you guys can still see like the whole friends list so it's not like brighten up for you so you can do that uh, and it also says you can also edit screenshots using photo mode and share factory so yeah guys we now have custom wallpapers all right guys next we will get a quick menu refresh so you know that quick menu when you hold the PS button that has been revamped it is a whole refresh uh, basically now that the quick menu doesn't take most of your screen it takes actually less of it now and then they added improvements to it so we did get a quick menu refresh, so that's pretty cool. Alright guys, so next we got a more simplified notification list. So before we only had like, we could only view like in the notification tab, I think we can only view like trophies, messages, and friends we added, I think. But now they made it more simpler. Now if we go to the notification tab, we'll have game alerts, downloads, uploads, and more. So that's pretty nice of them to do. So yeah all right guys so the last two updates we're gonna get is now we can post on playstation network activity feeds so if you guys know that what's new tab we can now customize it even more we can now post things like text screenshots and gifts directly into your activity feed so i think before we could only see people added trophies and stuff like that so it's gonna act more of like a Twitter thing now, which is pretty cool for them. So that's gonna be in the next update. All right, guys, so the last update we have is 3D Blu-rays on PlayStation VR. So personally, I don't have a VR, but now you can view 3D Blu-ray movies using the PlayStation VR, which is pretty cool for them. So yeah, and then finally they said at the last part, they said there are more features included in four point 50 so make sure to keep an eye out for additional info including launch timing in the weeks to come so they're gonna add more stuff but this is basically what they given us it's a big update so let's go over what we got so we got external hard drive supports that's a great feature custom wallpapers great quick menu refresh finally i hated how they had this big thing covering the whole screen but now they made it less on the screen simplified notification list and then we got post at playstation network activity feeds works kind of like twitter but yeah it's a big update uh we still don't have a an official launching time when it's actually going to be live so yeah guys that's basically it stay tuned for that update and thanks for watching